man who is a fugitive on a featured television show has been captured in Northwest Spokane. 55 year old Robert Reese was on the run for 13 years and was arrested Friday. He's accused of sex crimes involving a child out of Smith County, Texas. KXLY's Allie Norton working for you tonight and she spoke with people in that neighborhood where he was arrested. And Allie, I can imagine it's quite concerning for them. Well, definitely Aaron. While Reese has been arrested and is in police custody, this is a housing development with families with young children. So to find out that he was there for even a little time is a little unsettling for those living there. The search is over. Yeah, I was surprised because I didn't realize it was so close. For 13 years, 55 year old Robert Reese has been on the run from crimes he committed in Texas. And up until last night, Jane had no idea the fugitive had been in her neighborhood at all. Very concerning, very concerning because this is a pretty quiet, family friendly neighborhood. So it's very concerning. He's accused of indecent liberties with a child as well as aggravated sexual assault of a child. Concerning enough to put him on a television show. Hello, I'm John Walsh. We need your help to capture this fugitive. Reese was featured on the Justice Network back in March. Police need your help tracking down Robert Reese. Police did get that help. When the show aired, a tip came in that he had been living on a boat in Tacoma for the past 10 years. Reese must have saw the show too, because U.S. Marshals say he left Tacoma shortly after. But they were able to track him to this neighborhood where he was arrested on Friday, providing much relief to the people living here. I'm glad he was caught and it just um, is really important to know your neighbors and know who they are and keep in touch with each other. Now the big question is why did he come here and who is he staying with? Neighbors we spoke to say that he was doing maintenance at a home where a woman just moved into and neighbors say that she was very surprised when he was arrested and we have not been able to reach that homeowner. Reporting in the studio tonight, I'm Allie Norton, KXLY4 News. All right, thank you, Allie.